a war of flags have taken over Barcelona's balconies. Both pro and anti-independent supporters have been using their outside spaces to make clear where they stand on Catalonia's succession debate. Jaime Velázquez has the story. Pro-independence flags, Spanish flags, Catalan flags, banners for the release of the so-called political prisoners, yellow ribbons, the balconies of Barcelona have become the front line of a war of Catalan identities, but now landlords and community of owners are increasingly barring their tenants from displaying any signage in their buildings. The facade of the building belongs to the building's owners, so homeowners, after months or even years of having to suffer with a number of external elements, are now asking the administrators to make arrangements for these elements to be removed. A recent survey shows Catalans are virtually split down the middle between those who support independence and those who want to remain part of Spain, but 70% of them agree it's now time for some sort of mutual understanding. I think this is going in the same direction. In this country, I don't mean in Catalonia, but in Spain, we will have less and less freedom, so I'm going to keep my flag in my balcony. A separatist flag, of course. In my building, there's the case of a neighbor who has a pro-independence flag. And well, there are some tensions. Some people want to display the Spanish flag. It's been reported that almost half the new lease contracts signed in Barcelona are restricting neighbors from displaying flags in their balconies. But should freedom of expression prevail over the landlord wishes? If you, for example, are wearing a flag on the streets, you can do it and nobody can tell you anything. It's your freedom to wear it because it's you wearing it. But when you put a flag on a facade, then that belongs to a community of neighbors. The war of flags has also reached the balconies and facades of public buildings like the regional government of Catalonia. The Electoral Commission has requested the Catalan Premier to remove all signage ahead of the general elections. Legal or not, the flags are not likely to disappear from Barcelona's balconies, at least until Catalans come to terms with their identity and each other. From Barcelona, Jaime Velázquez, Euronews.